Hey. You. Yes, you, you idiot. Are you tired of not getting what you want from the workplace? Tired of people running over you because you're too much of a wimp to stand up for yourself? Well then, this is for you! What is? How to be passive aggressive office edition is the perfect tool for the everyday outcast in your workplace. For only 15 payments of 19.99, you can go from wimp to, wow, that guy's a jerk in only three weeks. Take Carl, for instance. After only watching the first few hours of our groundbreaking DVD, Carl is ready to take on the heartless ice queen known as Brenda from accounting. Let's watch. Brenda? Yeah, 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 yes, Carl? I, uh, uh, May I, I help I, you with something? Uh, uh, I just wanted to know if you had those audits ready for, for the fisherman's account. It's kind of urgent. Oh, is it, Carl? Is it urgent? Yeah, 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 yes. It, it, it's an important account I'd like to close, so if you don't uh, mind... Well, I, I, you know what I, I'd like to close, Carl? What? That stammering pie hole in the middle of your face. You know what really gets me, Paul? It, it's Carl. As if I cared. It's men like you who come marching down here with your big boy pants on because you learned you can do it all by yourself this time. Well, guess what? What? I'll have that audit ready when I think it's ready. And guess what else? What? It ain't ready yet. Got me? Uh, uh, sure. It's just... Go on, Carl. It's just, you see, I gave you the audit a month ago and it's um, overdue by two weeks already. I just find it interesting how you can sprint three floors to the executive lobby for French Fry Friday and two blocks down to the nail saloon for Manny Petty Monday, but you can't finish a four-page audit in six weeks. It's a wonder they haven't promoted you sooner. Great job, Carl. <laughs> OMG, can you believe they only gave us 10 weeks to perform the system diagnostics on the latest firewall program? I mean, that should take like 11 at the least. Yeah, and they give us 50 vacation days, but no temporary health benefits. Are you kidding me? I know. Oh my God, what if you break a nail? That's sexist, Carl. <laughs> Congratulations, Carl. You're now equipped with the skills necessary to make it in this fast-paced dog-eat-dog world of the work environment. Although in retrospect, if you have this many issues working with women, Barbara Cochran and Associates probably wasn't the place for you. <laughs> well, good luck to you, Carl. How to be passive-aggressive off edition cannot and will not be held liable for resulting in violence in the workplace. Results in this case cannot be expected in other cases and should be evaluated on a case-by-case -case basis. Potential side effects include nausea, vomiting, social isolation, permanent side-eye from your coworkers, and permanent loss of your job. Um, in second grade, I had a crush on this 
kid named Nick Danello. Um, I, to this day, have never had a conversation with him. But so I was in like this smart kid class, and he was not, but he was cute. So uh, one day in second grade, I cut a hole in my Dunkin' Donuts lunchbox, and I put a camera inside, and I secretly took pictures of him on the playground. Which is exactly what pedophiles do. Butter caviar. Oh my god, Kimmy Schmidt. Caviar, Myanmar, mid sized car, <laughs> <laughs> retweet. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> um, I think I'll take the breadsticks and a Pinot Noir. <laughs> um, I'll just have the curly fries. Fries before guys, am I right? Oh my god, retweet. <gasps> okay. Oh, I was just kidding about the Pinot Noir. Like I could afford that. Oh my god, girl, retweeting that. I am so broke right now. TBH. I could barely afford this dress. I'm in more debt than Kanye. Oh my god, retweet! <laughs> Seriously. Well, that was fast. Are you all ready to order an entree? Our special today is the seared record lamb with our mint julep sauce and just a touch of fig. Did he just say fig? How much would that... Yeah, I'll take the side salad. Yeah, I'll have a side salad too with... um. <clears throat> Just a side of blue cheese, please. Dressing. We're on a diet. Yeah, the paleo <laughs> diet. You did paleo? How about paleo? No. Oh my god, retweet! <laughs> retweet it, girl. Good lord, what are y'all talking about, this retweeting nonsense? Can I just get y'all's orders? Um, it's called Twitter. Ever heard of it? <laughs> of course I heard of it. Good lord, child, when did you think I was born? Oh no, no, you look so young. I didn't mean it like that. Yeah, we just go on Twitter to follow Kim Kardashian. <laughs> oh my lord, Kim Kardashian? I love her. She's got a really big bum, don't she? Are you twerking? You're like so good at twerking. Can you also nay-nay? What, like this? Yeah. Ooh. So can you just get us the salads? Oh. Thanks. Thank you. 
Do you want to try it? Free food. Free food. Oh my god, let's retweet. do it. Let's do it. Okay, okay. retweet. We can totally do it. I we think this guy. He really just. We got it. I and think that's what's important. I think like the next step is. Here are y'all salads. Kim K is Bay. <laughs> what? You know, uh, Kim Kardashian. Oh my God, you're so funny. <laughs> oh my God, yeah, Kim K is Bay. Retweet. <laughs> you know what? You girls are so pretty. These salads here are on the house. Oh my God, you're oh. so sweet. Oh my God, I love your shoes. Where did you get those? Nordstrom's. <laughs> I wish my boyfriend dressed like you. He has no sense of style. Oh my God, reach me. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, ladies. You know what? I may not be a super great waiter while giving out free food and all, but my fashion sense is louder than Oprah on her free gift days. Oh my God, reach me. Oh my stars. I love you girls. You know what? I'll just bring you out the peanut on the wall right now. It's on me tonight. Oh my God, retweet. It'll be right out here on the flippy flop. Oh my god, I love you so much. You know what? I'll just bring you all the lamb and the Pinot Noir while I'm at it. <gasps> Pinot Noir and the Boutoir! And y'all can retweet that. <laughs> hey, look, it's those guys. Uh, Are you good to try? I'm fine. How many did you have? I should be fine. You should be? Go and step out of the vehicle for me. See ya, buddy. Good luck. So it turns out, buzz driving and drunk driving, they're the same thing. And it costs around $10,000. So not worth it. Hey, did you know 2.4 million loving cats and dogs in shelters and rescues need our help to find a home? Let's go to the shelterpetproject.org and meet a few who are in a shelter near you. Harlo. Oh, she's one great listener who loves to hear all your stories. My kind of cat. Cerulo is a sweet, goofy boy who's eager to please. Sounds just like another dog I know. So go to the shelterpetproject.org, search your local shelters and rescues, and go for a cuddle with your next best friend. Adopt. Take a look under your bed. Find stuff under there? What about jobs? No? Now try your closet. Still no jobs? Just more stuff? Well, you really have both. See, stuff is defined as household articles considered as a group. Sometimes this stuff is no longer needed. Wait, no longer needed? I can't be right. Because remember those jobs you were looking for? Those are really needed. And they're the stuff inside your stuff. Our job is to unlock those jobs. And it starts when you donate your stuff to your local Goodwill. Here's how we do it. When you donate to Goodwill, we sell your stuff to provide job training for people right here in your community. So just by teaming up with Goodwill, you help create jobs. And isn't that worth parting with the leftover guitar from your 80s cover band? Goodwill. Donate stuff, create jobs. I will not be news today. I will not make another push to be the first man in space with frosted tips and a puka shell necklace. And I will not go viral when my terror is caught on camera when I finally realize that in the vacuum of space, no one can hear you sing. I'm Lance Bass, and I will not be trending today because there is a much bigger story that needs to be heard. Start a story. Adopt at the shelterpetproject.org. I will not be news today. I will not make headlines by going through a bad girl phase where I get that bad girl haircut where they shave just one side of your head. And I will hey, not bring a Komodo dragon as my plus one to an award show, even though that would be awesome. 
I'm Olivia Munn, and I will not be trending today because there's a much bigger story that needs to be heard. This is the story of a boy who didn't talk for a long time. The boy liked things to always be the same. Any changes would scare and upset him. The unknown was an unfriendly place. The boy was very sensitive to lights and sounds. So he built secret hiding places where they couldn't get in. The boy didn't like looking people in the eye. He wasn't trying to be mean, it just made him feel uncomfortable. Sometimes he would flap his arms again and again. One day I found out I had something called autism. My family got me help. Slowly I found my voice and learned all the way I could live with it better. Early intervention can make a lifetime of difference. Learn the signs at autismspeaks.org. Hey, I'm Tyler Perry. Do you know what hunger in America looks like? Well, it has many faces, and 16 million of those belong to children. Yet billions of pounds of food go to waste each year, and this is unacceptable. You can be a part of the solution. Join us in supporting the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks, which rescues our surplus foods and provides meals to many families in need. Visit feedingamerica.org today. Together, we can solve hunger. Together, we're Feeding America. I want to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I need to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Why can't I eat, eat, eat? One in five children struggles with hunger in America. Support the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks to help provide meals to those in need. Join us at feedingamerica.org. There are 16 million children struggling with hunger in America. That's one in five daughters, sons, neighbors, and classmates who don't know where their next meal is coming from. Yet billions of pounds of good food go to waste every year. It's time we do something about it. Feeding America is a nationwide network of food banks that helps provide meals to millions of kids and families in need. Visit feedingamerica.org to help them feed even more. Together, we can solve hunger. Together, we're Feeding America. Alvin and the Chipmunks want to remind you, bacteria can hide in food and make you ill. Wow. But you can keep bacteria from ruining your day with four simple steps. Clean. I'm waiting for the rinse cycle. Separate. <laughs> cook. Fire in the hole. And chill. We Chipmunks are notoriously tidy. Check your steps. The road trip to food safety starts at foodsafety.gov. Your daughter just had her first breakup. Do you A, put yourself in her shoes? B, console her? Don't worry, sweetie. This is gonna happen a lot. Or C, find her a new boyfriend. Nice, single boys. <laughs> that was weird. As a parent, there are no perfect answers, but you don't have to be perfect to be a perfect parent. Thousands of teens in foster care will love you just the same. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I want to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I need to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Why can't I eat, eat, eat apples and bananas? One in five children struggles with hunger in America. Support the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks to help provide meals to those in need. Join us at feedingamerica.org. As we can see from the first few chapters, Moby Dick is the literal devil, and Melissa, showing up to class tardy, are we? Sorry, Miss Stewart, my dog and I were having some issues. Melissa, an issue with a pet is not an excuse for showing up late to my class. Uh, no, 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 I meant like my dog, Jonathan, he's a freshman. 
I thought I was being nice, and I lent him my favorite number two Ticonderoga last period, and I got it back with bite marks the size of ditches. That, that's too much information. Just show up to class on time. Don't worry. Can we get the seat nice and warm for your tardy butt? Can no. anybody tell me what the first line of Moby Dick is? Gilvy thus. I believe it was. Call me Bond. James Bond. <laughs> Give it us. We have a lot of material to cover today, and I'd appreciate some more serious answers. Was that not correct? Okay. I swear, that girl can't say any phrase correctly. Kevin, she's only All been right, in the country. Turn to like... chapter three in your books and start reading. We'll have a quiz tomorrow. The, every single reference she makes is so far off. She's like the Kanye West of expression. <laughs> Just leave it be, man. The class clown is an esteemed role. Like the guy who sleeps, uh, you know, during class. <laughs> Guys, sh she can hear you. Good morning, me, Lisa. I was very nervous when you weren't in class today. Oh, it, it wasn't. I actually it's made wasn't. my body sweat like Nile River. <laughs> oh, I haven't heard that one before. Hey, Giladoc, <laughs> thanks for coming to the game Saturday. The body paint was a magnificent touch. Oh, it was my own pleasure. I was on my way to a friend's house when I thought, why not root for a team? Punch basket! That's actually pretty thoughtful. And Kevin, do not get me started. You play like Meister, like Muhammad Ali once said, float like butterfly. And sting like... Hydrogen peroxide. A bee! It, Gilmadas, it's a freaking bee! Why can't you say any phrase correctly? I don't understand in mother country, this is how things are said. <laughs> Unless you live in another universe, people don't say the things the way you do. Not in Lithuania, not anywhere. Expressions are pretty out there, man. Think about the guy who coined, it's the fan. God, I hope that wasn't from personal experience. Hey, you look at us, you're ready for lunch later. Oh yes, I am so hungry I could eat loofah. Hey, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Who's this? It's my brother, Milos. It's his first day of school. Mama Juska sent him all the way from the mother country to see. Land, Land of the Good Burger. Burger. Home, Home of the, the Good Burger. Burger. Can, Can I take, take your order? order? <laughs> you must be friends of my sister Gil with us. Bless you all. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, you can oh, maybe yeah. say. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay Milos, I'm going to be honest. I think your sister is crazy. Like, borderline cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs crazy. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. She is just crazy for poor reality TV show. Kardashians, they are my favorite beautiful people. Yes, but you are not cuckoo crazy. <laughs> no one says the phrases she says. They are blatantly wrong. It's obvious that they don't come from a country for that matter. Kevin. I do not understand. Uh, i tell you what. I'll say the first part of a phrase and you'll finish it for me. Deal? Yes, I love game. <sighs> Life is like a box of... Of needles. <laughs> you miss 100% of the shots... That do not score. <laughs> Beauty is in the eye of... Morgan Freeman. <laughs> no, it, it runs in the family. I'm trying everything here, Gildas. It's. It must be true that you're not the sharpest tool in the... Chad! That's it! You've got it! I knew you must have been confused or something. When did you come up with that one anyway? Oh, that's, that is the, our favourite song from our movie Shrek by uh, Justin Bieber. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I give up! Class dismissed. Who wants cookout? Yeah! Oh, yeah yes, okay. cookout. Have it your way. <laughs> so close! So close. It's cool. It's got Who's that? Oh, it's Marco. Do you think it would be too much if I asked him how his day was, or is that too clingy? No, why would that be clingy? Okay. Wait, he texted you first, oh, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Hey.
Oh dear God. Never stop holding me, James. You know your arms are all I've ever known, or want to know. Kiss me, you big sea otter. <laughs> I'd be nothing, absolutely nothing, without you. What could he be doing that he couldn't respond? Watching a football game, a stupid video game, I mean what? I don't know. I can't handle this. Marco? Are you gonna answer that? <sighs> oh, oh, oh. Alright. <sighs> Hello? So, because you haven't responded to any of my text messages, I'm coming over. That's right, Marky Mark. I'm almost a Jonah. Oh, God. Guys, we gotta clean up. We have to clean up. What's the big deal? Get rid of the monkey. His name is Pumpkin. Hang on a second. You... Marco, you can't just scrub your face like that. You have to apply a toner to tighten the pores and then a light lotion to replenish the skin. Oh, you just need to be mad. It burns! It burns! This may never call me back, but at least I'll look good. I'll look good! 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 <laughs> Hey, you. Yeah, you. Getting that college education. What are you going to do? Graduate and take some office job? Be like everybody else. Or will you dare do something different? Like be a teacher. You could be my teacher. You got the skills. The smarts. Yes, you. You could be the teacher I never forget. That would be cool. Does that corporate job even have recess? What are you going to make of yourself? What are you going to make of me? Everybody has a dream. Mine was to see the ocean. And with a little help, I made it. I adopted Bento in 2010 from a shelter. As it turns out, we have very similar personalities. And this cat makes me make art because he's always motivating me to take pictures of him, to draw pictures of him. He just is motivating artistically. It's just that simple. Well, he's my best friend, but a lot of people know him as Keyboard Cat.
Five children struggles with hunger in America. Support the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks to help provide meals to those in need. Join us at feedingamerica.org. Brushing for two minutes now can save your child from severe tooth pain later. Two minutes, twice a day. They have the time. I adopted Bento in 2010 from a shelter. As it turns out, we have very similar personalities. And this cat makes me make art because he's always motivating me to take pictures of him, to draw pictures of him. He just is motivating artistically. It's just that simple. Well, he's my best friend, but a lot of people know him as Keyboard Cat. children's struggles with hunger in America. Support the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks to help provide meals to those in need. Join us at feedingamerica.org. Brushing for two minutes now can save your child from severe tooth pain later. Two minutes, twice a day. They have the time. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I want to eat. Apples and bananas. I need to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Why can't I eat, eat, eat apples and bananas? One in five children struggles with hunger in America. Support the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks to help provide meals to those in need. Join us at feedingamerica.org.
I will not be news today. I will not make headlines by going through a bad girl phase where I get that bad girl haircut where they shave just one side of your head. And I will hey, not bring a Komodo dragon as my plus one to an award show, even though that would be awesome. I'm Olivia Munn, and I will not be trending today because there's a much bigger story that needs to be heard. And Issa Goldstein. <laughs> I found myself dreaming in silver and gold. Like a scene in a movie that every broken heart knows We were walking on moonlight and you held me close Split second and you disappeared and then I was all alone Woke up in tears with you by my side Breath of relief and I realized no, and I promise tomorrow So I'm gonna love you Like I'm gonna lose you I'm gonna hold you Like we're saying goodbye Whenever we're standing I won't take you for granted That's how we'll know when When we'll run out of time of an eye just a whisper of smoke you can lose everything the truth is you'll never know so I'll kiss you longer babe every chance that I get make most of the minutes and love with no regrets let's take our time to Say what we want, use all we got before it's all gone. No, we're not promised tomorrow. So I'm gonna love you like I'm gonna lose you. I'm gonna hold you like we're saying goodbye. Whenever we're standing, I won't take you for Huh? huh, you're telling me. Mondays are the worst. You had a good weekend though, right? Yeah, definitely. My son was home from college, so we had a nice family dinner on Saturday night. Oh, nice. Yeah, what about you? Uh, me and the missus, we spent a night on the town to celebrate our anniversary on Saturday, and on Sunday, uh, we spent the day with my parents. It was just a good time. That sounds excellent. Oh, it definitely was. What's up, nerds? Hey, Trey. 
How was your weekend? Uh, mine was good, actually. I eh, too boring. Beth, go. Uh, uh, my son was home from college, so we had a fit. My turn. All right, listen up, turds. Booze, babes, museums, tons of NyQuil. Rinse, repeat. Am I right? Um, not sure where you're going with this. Group. Have you ever had your hand? Have you ever had your hands inside a live dolphin in the middle of a hurricane? Uh, n no. Well, neither have I. But I'll tell you what. You, me, Breath. My name is Beth. We're going clubbing tonight. What's up? Trey, it's Monday. Uh, Bo, let me ask you something. Did it ever stop Jimi Hendrix? Did it ever stop Belushi? Those guys are dead. Drew! <laughs> Don't you dare. Trey? Uh, hey, what's up, man? How's it going? Yeah, I uh, got your numbers today for the quarter, and based on your behavior and your performance, we're going to have to let you go. Wow, bro. That's harsh. You know what? Life is about making difficult decisions. And I respect you for that. Thank you. So, uh, so which is why you, me, Jeff, Drew, and Phyllis. We have worked together for three years. <laughs> We're skipping work, going to the aquarium, finishing a handle of Jack, and skinny dipping with some marine life. We must be down. Please get out. All right. Yeah. All right. You're all missing out. <laughs> Hamilton was adopted from a rescue in 2008. He really likes to be around people. And as soon as I start to make my breakfast, Hamilton is right there. I get out my mat, and I'm doing a downward dog, and he's underneath. He's quite the pug about town. He gets invited to a lot of parties. He knows he's a pretty big deal. I mean, look at this little face. How did you not love him? I rescued Toast from a shelter in 2011. I love Toast because she's a lazy diva. Toast does whatever she wants, obviously. She's sleeping right now. She's an epic snuggler. She's so comforting. She's so loving. Toast makes me laugh. <laughs> when I walked into the shelter, I knew right then that she was special. Chipmunks want to remind you, bacteria can hide in food and make you ill. Wow. But you can keep bacteria from ruining your day with four simple steps. Clean. I'm waiting for the rinse cycle. Separate. <laughs> Cook. Fire in the hole. And chill. We chipmunks are notoriously tidy. Check your steps. The road trip to food safety starts at foodsafety.gov. There are 16 million children struggling with hunger in America. That's one in five daughters, sons, neighbors, and classmates who don't know where their next meal is coming from. Yet billions of pounds of good food go to waste every year. It's time we do something about it. Feeding America is a nationwide network of food banks that helps provide meals to millions of kids and families in need. Visit feedingamerica.org to help them feed even more. Together, we can solve hunger. Together, we're Feeding America. Your daughter just had her first breakup. Do you A, put yourself in her shoes? B, console her? Don't worry, sweetie. This is gonna happen a lot. Or C, find her a new boyfriend. Nice single boys. <laughs> that was weird. As a parent, there are no perfect answers. But you don't have to be perfect to be a perfect parent. Thousands of teens in foster care will love you just the same. I want to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I need to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Why can't I eat, eat, eat? One in five children struggles with hunger in America. Support the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks to help provide meals to those in need. Join us at feedingamerica.org.
start a story. Adopt at the shelterpetproject.org. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Getting that college education. What are you gonna do? Graduate and take some office job? Be like everybody else. Or will you dare do something different? Like be a teacher. You could be my teacher. You got the skills, the smarts. Yes, you. You could be the teacher I never forget. That would be cool. Does that corporate job even have recess? What are you gonna make of yourself? What are you gonna make of me? Everybody has a dream. Mine was to see the ocean. And with a little help, I made it. Hey, did you know 2.4 million loving cats and dogs in shelters and rescues need our help to find a home? Let's go to the shelterpetproject.org and meet a few who are in a shelter near you. Harlo. Oh, she's one great listener who loves to hear all your stories. My kind of cat. Cerulo is a sweet, goofy boy who's eager to please. Sounds just like another dog I know. So go to the shelterpetproject.org, search your local shelters and rescues, and go for a cuddle with your next best friend. Adopt. Hey, look, it's those guys. Get some drinks! <laughs> uh, Are you good to drive? I'm fine. How many did you have? I should be fine. You should be? Go and step out of the vehicle for me. See ya, buddy. Good luck. So it turns out, buzz driving and drunk driving, they're the same thing. And it costs around $10,000. So not worth it. Jamming out to Molly late at night, uh Staying up to watch every sunrise Just living like we ain't gonna die, uh Everybody said I was crazy Yeah, everybody said you'd be gone, uh I know I'm supposed to forget you And boy, you know I moved on But every time I'm driving with the top down, baby I remember sneaking out in your car Jumped into the ocean while the sun kissed on me was a sucker for them boys with wild hearts I'll be cool with it, done with it You're never on my mind Till I feel the heat of you and me It hits me every summer Remember when no one else could make me feel alive We were young and free, 17 just California lovers Ooh yeah, teaching me the skate down the boardwalk I'm crashing into you like a wave, uh even if it was only small talk, you only knew the right things to say, uh. Everybody said I was stupid for thinking that my first web would last. Even though it ended in heartache, sometimes I want to go back. Cause every time I'm driving with the top down, baby, I remember sneaking out in your car. Jumped into the ocean while the sun kissed on me Was a sucker for them boys with wild hearts I'll be cool with it, done with it You're never on my mind Till I feel the heat of you and me It hits me every summer Remember when no one else could make me feel alive We were young and free, 17 just California lovers Man, Frankie, I've been feeling pretty down lately. The sixth grade bully, Chloe Flanagan, keeps making fun of me because Daddy went to, to an affair with her mom and they did rides all night long. I wish Chloe would just mind her own beeswax. Hello, hello. How are we doing? Stranger danger! <laughs> no, Stevie, I'm a genie and I'm here to grant you one magical wish. Oh, this must be my lucky day. Okay, well, I guess if I had one wish, it would probably be... No, stop, stop. I'm going to have to cut you off. I'm sorry. I, I can't do this. What do you mean? It's been a rough month, Sleazy Stevie. Why? Well, 
You ever heard of an STD? No. <laughs> what is it? Well, something your ex-wife gives you after taking the money, the kids, the beach house, the lamp. <laughs> the lamp. And then your family cuts you off because you have a drinking problem? Well, guess what, Jasmine? Sorry I'm not as perfect as Ray the neurosurgeon. Um, genie? I mean, I'm a genie for crying out loud. That idiot from The Apprentice asked to be president, and now look what's happening. Wait, you're the reason? You ain't got proof. Genie, I don't want to be president. I just want Chloe Flanagan to shut up. Chloe Flanagan? Yes. I knew someone named Chloe Flanagan once. Oh, really? Yeah, he was like Chloe Flanagan. You know where he is? No. His feet up on my table in my lamp next to my wife. Oh, and your kids? That's less important, less important. <laughs> Jeannie, am I going to get any wishes granted or no? Yes, sorry, okay. <sighs> Let's do this. Okay, okay. I wish that Chloe Flanagan got bit by a cobra in the <laughs> butt and got sentenced to prison for 10 years and got one of those STDs. Uh, no, I think you mean like stung by a bee, right? Yeah, yeah, that. And died. <laughs> okay, uh, everything but that last part. Okay. Um, all right, let's go. Alakazoo, Alakazee, make Chloe Flanagan get stung by a... Make Chloe Flanagan get stung by a... <laughs> I get my wife, she used to say Alakazee. <laughs> Jeannie, I give up. I'm going to bed. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah? Can I crash on your couch? I'm, I'm lampless. I really wish you wouldn't. Wish. If you say so. That was your one wish for the month, which means I've met my quota. Jeannie, out. Hey, I'm Tyler Perry. Do you know what hunger in America looks like? Well, it has many faces, and 16 million of those belong to children. Yet billions of pounds of food go to waste each year, and this is unacceptable. You can be a part of the solution. Join us in supporting the Feeding America nationwide network of food banks, which rescues our surplus foods and provides meals to many families in need. Visit feedingamerica.org today. Together, we can solve hunger. Together, we're Feeding America. This is the story of a boy who didn't talk for a long time. The boy liked things to always be the same. Any changes would scare and upset him. The unknown was an unfriendly place. The boy was very sensitive to lights and sounds. So he built secret hiding places where they couldn't get in. The boy didn't like looking people in the eye. He wasn't trying to be mean, it just made him feel uncomfortable. Sometimes he would flap his arms again and again. One day I found out I have something called autism. My family got me help. Slowly, I found my voice and learned all the way I could live with it better. Early intervention can make a lifetime of difference. Learn the signs at autismspeaks.org. I will not be news today. I will not make headlines by going through a bad girl phase where I get that bad girl haircut where they shave just one side of your head. And I will hey, not bring a Komodo dragon as my plus one to an award show, even though that would be awesome. I'm Olivia Munn, and I will not be trending today because there's a much bigger story that needs to be heard. Hey, look, it's those guys. Are you good to drive? I'm fine. How many did you have? I should be fine. You should be? Go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me. See ya, buddy. Good luck. So it turns out, buzz driving and drunk driving, they're the same thing. And it costs around $10,000. So not worth it. 
Hey, did you know 2.4 million loving cats and dogs in shelters and rescues need our help to find a home? Let's go to the shelterpetproject.org and meet a few are in a shelter near you. Harlow. Oh, she's one great listener who loves to hear all your stories. My kind of cat. Shrulo is a sweet, goofy boy who's eager to please. Sounds just like another dog I know. So go to the shelterpetproject.org, search your local shelters and rescues, and go for a cuddle with your next best friend. Adopt. Take a look under your bed. Find stuff under there? What about jobs? No? Now try your closet. Still no jobs? Just more stuff? Well, you really have both. See, stuff is defined as household articles considered as a group. Sometimes this stuff is no longer needed. Wait, no longer needed? I can't be right. Because remember those jobs you were looking for? Those are really needed. And they're the stuff inside your stuff. Our job is to unlock those jobs. And it starts when you donate your stuff to your local Goodwill. Here's how we do it. When you donate to Goodwill, we sell your stuff to provide job training for people right here in your community. So just by teaming up with Goodwill, you help create jobs. And isn't that worth parting with the leftover guitar from your 80s cover band? Goodwill. Donate stuff, create jobs. Everybody has a dream. Mine was to see the ocean. And with a little help, I made it. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you so much, everyone, for coming. Thank you to Kelsey and Ace, our great musical guests. Thank you so much to ESTV for letting us do this. We had so much fun. Thank you so much to our engineers and our tech crew, most of whom were makeshift for today. So thank you so much, your lifesavers. And that is our show. Good night, everybody. Woo!